Had to pull up on West Fat Head, man. Look at him. Yeah, hey, nah. Hey, they be dirty right now, man. Don't look at it, bro. Yeah, Fat Head, you too. I did be getting gas as usual. We had to fill up real quick. We finna actually hit Summit and hopefully we can get that passenger side gasket. Hopefully they don't cost too much and I'm gonna get both of them and then have the second one whenever I feel like replacing the other one, we're gonna take care of the passenger side first. Cause this side is doing the most leaking, which is the passenger side. So we're gonna go ahead and knock this side. God damn, after we get some gas, we ain't gonna really fill it up. I think I'ma just do God damn about 40 probably. Cause I ain't really going to work this weekend. I ain't really going nowhere for real. You know what I mean? Well, it ain't no fucking way, gang. <laughs> ain't no way. This guy right here so hard, gang. Wow, by the hell, cat. But y'all know we are, and it's a red eye. But y'all know we at, we at Summit, man. We came up here to get some parts, man. Hopefully they got the head gasket that I need. You know what I mean? If they don't got it, then it is what it is, man. But we finna walk in Summit, man. Good thing I got one of these in my state. You feel me? That bit hell so hard, boy. Look at the paint flipping off that bed, boy. That could have did better than the mufflers, though. It bit hard. Um, Got that engine in that bit, man. God damn. Wow. 
out with them pedal shifters. Mess up with something, you see what I'm saying? see i got black beast right here in the background what we finna do finna go ahead and replace this passenger side um head of gasket and get rid of that leak man so that's what i plan on doing today today's saturday let me see what time it is it's actually 8 53 man and we finna go ahead and get started i'm finna go ahead and get some wood so i can get the jack under there and jack the car up uh we're just gonna do one side today and probably do another side like net weekend or something because the driver side easy the the hardest thing is the passenger side because i got to remove more things you know what i'm saying i gotta take the starter off uh i think i'm gonna end up taking the alternator off too so i can slide my uh, arm from the front side to the back you feel me in that little space because it is small and i do have big hands and i have a big arm you feel me so to to stop that process or pretty much uh, get this process going. We gotta go get the wood real quick. Dry the car up, jack the car up, and then after that, we should be able to start. Uh, right now, I can't get a jack under my car, so that's what we gotta get the wood for, if y'all didn't know. But Black Bee's right here, looking as good as she wants to, you feel me? So glad I went ahead and got the fuser, because it completed the car. And if y'all don't know, this right here is for the Chrysler 300s, man. And I put it on the eight, man, the, the charger, you feel me? I put that on the the, 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 the SRT8 charger. 
you feel me so that's different i was gonna go srt and then paint it black but i didn't want to do that because i felt like it was going to take away from the actual badge so i went with the black and silver still got to put my 392 badges on the side probably gonna do that today i gotta watch the cart as well um so yeah we gotta do all that and if y'all didn't know my headlights are tinted so i'll be trying to show y'all but sometimes you can see it sometimes you can't but from right here you can tell that they're tinted and look how that drop look man oh my god look at that oh my god a lot of people been asking me why do i want to uh i think i already done bit i already done bit new fender right here because it's low <laughs> but um a lot of folks been asking why do i want to go deem i mean get away from the demons it's because bro everybody got them now bro i want my car to stand out from people you feel me like when i put these on not too many people had these on the the seven gen chargers bro the the eights and stuff like that no they don't got them bro i'm not trying to say i set the trend or nothing i'm just saying it wasn't that many but it's like no every time i turn my head i see one with some on you feel me so it's like i just gotta stand out bro i don't know if i want to I don't know. I might just go with some five aftermarket wheels and just get away from Dodge rims, period. You feel me? So we're going to see, gang. Y'all stay tuned. But that's not what we came for. We came for the header install. So we finna go ahead and take this right side header off, passenger side header off, and we finna get started, man. The more we talk, the less we get done. So let's get to it. Gang, what is going, man? I've been out here, man, getting it done. I got six bolts out. I only got two more bolts and I got to get those from the top. That's the two that's in the middle, sort of. But all the ones at the bottom I can get are out. Going back in, I might take this tire off. I don't know yet. Uh, it would give me a little bit more room, but I don't have to take it off. I'm not going to take it off. But, um, yeah, as y'all see, we got six bolts right there. And like I said, two more that's at the top. And after that, head out. So we're going to go ahead and put the goddamn new on the gasket on, man. We're going to strip it off. Strip all the excess uh ceiling, whatever you want to call it off. I had brought some more um permatech, but I'm not gonna use it because they say you don't really need it. So these are supposed to be some great um gaskets. I supposed to torque these to uh 24 foot pounds. So I am gonna probably torque them down also. So they I don't risk a they, that's that's what's going on. I didn't torque my header boat, so they're gonna come out. Now this time I am thinking about torquing them down uh so i don't risk the um exhaust leak again or head elite so that's why i got the head elite gain is because i don't torque none of my boats down so when i do my cam i gotta make sure i go get me a, a torque wrench so i can torque every boat down that needs to be torqued down to expect you feel me um that's another thing why cars don't do what they need to do man you gotta torque these boats if you um don't torque them like i said you risk doing what i'm doing you feel me if i were to torque my boats this probably will never happen, you feel me? So this time I'm gonna torque them. Like I said, this is supposed to be the best gasket there is. Uh, let me see. I think they say, I think he said they copper gaskets or something like that. It says guaranteed to stop exhaust leaks, 50% crest seal wrap and pitted flanges, uh, solid graphic gaskets, good to 3000 Fahrenheit, and also no re-torquing required. So if I torque it, I don't have to keep tighten up the boats like i told y'all y'all gotta keep tying y'all head of boats nah if i actually torque it to spec i ain't gotta keep getting under there and do it and this time i'm gonna torque my boats like i said so with that being said man make sure y'all subscribe if you ain't subscribed already and yo we finna got name go ahead and get this done like i said two more boats to go and we done bro with the passenger side how it's going i might be able to do the driver side too if i can get them in there good you feel me all right gang so i know i said i got two more boats I gotta pop the hood in order to get to those last two. Mm. Got the badges right there, cause like I said, I might. I'm not gonna wash the car, cause it's supposed to rain uh, tomorrow. Excuse me. So I'm just gonna uh, clean the area and just put the 392 badges on there. I gotta go get some more 3M glue because I'm gonna put the Hemi under it too. So it's gonna say 392 and then hit me under it. It don't look good with just a 392 to me. So we're gonna do that. But like I was saying, man, the last two bolts, I think I gotta get from the top. I don't think I can get it from the bottom. I see one of them, but I don't have the angle that I need in order to make that work. So my hood be going down. So I gotta use this game. Let's see. 
gotta use that little thing right there to hold my hood up because my god dang uh i don't know what you call these but the little pressure things they're weak so i gotta buy some more of these i already got them in my amazon cart you feel me everybody be asking where i get my stuff from amazon bro amazon i get everything from amazon front lip splitter amazon side skirts amazon the rear amazon diffuser amazon tips amazon bro all this shit amazon bro I ain't got a goddamn holding that from y'all boys, man. The only thing I am holding is the SRT, bro. They don't even sell these no more. I wanted some different ones. I wanted to get the uh, carbon fiber, but they don't have them. I was going to get these away to one of my uh, subscribers, but I can't know because they stopped making the ones with SRT on it. So it is what it is, gang. So like I said, man, we got two more boats and they up here. Uh, I seen t uh, like a video dude took the ignition coils off right here and um they replaced the boat shark there and yeah so we're gonna definitely try that real quick i think that might work like i said all the boats are right here it's six boats right there it's eight boats in total so i know i got two more they right here in the middle i got the ones out the front i got the ones out the bottom all that it's just two right here at the top that i gotta get it might be one at the top and one at the bottom but we're gonna see it's two in there still as y'all see, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. One more boat. And just like that, gang, the header is finally out, bro. I give you a time frame when I get off Nunny Hill. But, gang, as y'all see, as y'all see, man, y'all see what's going on, bro. The header was leaking from right there in the freaking middle. Let me see if I get my hand. Boom, header was leaking. Ugh. Header was leaking back here. As you see, the gasket was kind of tore up. I got to strip all this stuff off of here, gang. Get all that junk off of there. We're not going back with none of that junk. When we do go back in, but as you see, I left this one boat in. You know, the bottom header, it slides on top. So all you see how all that slides on top? This is just like the header. So I could put these boats in and get them started. The only ones I had to really put in is these. One, two, three, and then there's one more. Well, three more on that side. So it's really nine boats um, in total for this right here. And man, I tell y'all, it's way easier than it was the first time. I didn't have that much trouble as I did the first, I mean, this time that I did the first time. So right now, I'll just snatch the gasket off. I'm gonna show y'all. Like I said, this one right here is where it was leaking at, right there. And it was leaking from back here too. As you see the black smut, I always see the black smut, that's where it was leaking. You feel me? So gang, I'm gonna take this to the shop and scrape all this stuff off and get it prepared to go back in. I'm not using that sealant stuff going back because there's no need. That's really what caused my exhaust leak, this stuff that I put on here. So we're going to take all this off. Like I said, you can look on here and tell where I was leaking at. And it was leaking from around here. It was leaking from around this one right here. And this first one, the first one is where it really was coming from. It was seeping from around that one I seen. But we finna go clean this up and get it back in the car. Uh, like I said, I started around nine. It is three, I say about 3.30 now. And no, I did not rush. Yes, I took a break and all that. So I'm not really rushing. Will I, will I do headers again? Yeah. If you want me to do your headers, you got to come bring your car. And um, you got to give me like at least two days because I don't like to rush. And it, should, it might be done before two days, you feel me? But I like to give myself time because I don't want to um, put myself on a time limit and have your car your car rushed out. So if you want to get your car done and you see that I'm doing my work and you want to get it done for a fair price, man, just hit me up, bro. That's all I can tell you, man. With that being said, like I said in every video, make sure you subscribe, man. Just like that. Clean it up. So I'm finna, finna get it done some more, get it down some more, and 
yeah, we're going to call it a day, gang. Like, y'all see the little black smut right there, like, stuff like that. I'm going to go ahead and clean it up, make it look new again. I pretty much got all the red stuff off that I used. But we're going to go ahead and clean it up some moto and put them back on. And just like that, gang, we're going to consider that done. We'll go ahead and put them back on, man. As y'all see, the header still look good. I don't see no big, big dings or bangs from me hitting them or dragging them or anything of that nature. So we good. Inspection for the head. Excuse the goddamn chicken, the rooster, whatever you want to call it. But, yeah, everybody keep asking me what headers I got on, bro. I keep telling y'all, bro, these some cheap version headers, bro. It ain't got no name on it. You feel me? Everybody was like, what, what what headers you got? Bro, I don't know. All I can tell you, the, I brought the last one. Some had one left. They had two. And then I got, they ain't had it in my cart. I seen it had one left and I brought it. When I brought it, I was finna buy another set because I was finna sell them. But guess what? None available, bro. They stopped selling them, bro, because they didn't come with cats. You know what I mean? But yeah, finna go ahead and put it back in. Well, we got to clean the bottom. We got to go clean the, um, the engine now. Then it's gonna be done, but as y'all see, this all the stuff that we um got to come off, and I just use some fine sandpaper to just just sand it down, man. Just got it right like that, like you know what I mean. Make them look new again for real. Just so got ain't gonna run into no more problems. But I already know this is gonna sound good. I'm ready to get rid of that leak, man. If y'all haven't already, make sure y'all like the freaking video, bro. Like the freaking video. You see how smashing they got named Brick, bro? Do the like button just like that, man. Don't forget to like the videos, bro. Y'all got to like the videos in order to get the videos to be pushed out. You know what I mean? Heck yeah, that one done. We just going to got to clean it to the top just a little bit more. Make them look brand new. And I, like I said, I'm not going to do the driver's side today because this is the only side that was leaking. Now, if I crank it up in the driver's side leaking, then, of course, I got to do the driver's side. But I'm going to do the driver's side, like, probably, like, on the weekend that I ain't got nothing planned. There we go. We good. Gang, I don't think y'all understand, bro. You can't get no cleaner than that, bro. Like, it got clean. It got clean, bro. I might clean up just a little bit more, like in little spots, like that right though. And then like that right though. And then over here, that's it. But other than that, she clean. Gang, I told y'all the reason why I was leaking, man. And I, and I did not read this. I just read this, right? So it says, do not use sealer. Silicone and other sealers cannot withstand the same temperature as basically this gasket. And you can actually cause leaks. So, man, the sealing was called, would cause my leak, bro, because it couldn't withstand it. And it actually blew from around the freaking pipe, bro. That's why I was leaking, man. Dang, so I already got the gasket up there, man. I'm finna go ahead and put this up. And we gonna call it a day, man. Like you played me. How you played yourself? I'm in the field deep, feeling like a ref. Have you ever had a feeling like no one is there? I've been on my own, don't need nobody here. Thank you, play me. Now you played yourself. I'm in the field deep, feeling like a ref. Have you ever had a feeling like no one is there? I've been on my own, don't need nobody here. Right on my mind, I've been on my grind. It's my time to shine. I hit rock right bottom, shawty left my sign. Left her behind. Don't need her in my way, trying to stop my grind. A man ain't gon' eat if he don't work. I may still sin, but I still go to church. How you gon' judge me like you perfect? That argument ain't worth it. I'm on my way up and I can feel it. Can't wait for it to come. I wanna see what We're good, game, man. Look, your boy's still out here. I know it's nighttime, though. But look, man, I ain't got a rest when it's in my car. You feel me? So, right now, all I got to do is put the starter on, tighten the mid pipe, and I got one more header bolt left. Then after that, we're going to come back in and hook up the battery. With that being said, man, if y'all haven't liked this video yet, man, what is you doing, bro? 
I done sat here and did all this and showed y'all the work, man. Y'all ain't got things show me no appreciation, bro. God dang, I done showed y'all how to fix a hemi tick, how to got dang stop an exhaust uh, leak, and how to um and to how and how to stop a header leak. If that ain't enough, man, I don't know what to tell y'all, man. Y'all should stride, bro, because we're going to 10K by the end of this year. I'm assuming for 10K, I'm assuming summertime for 10K, hopefully. That's what I'm shooting for. By the end of this year, I hope I'm close as hell to 100K. You feel me? So that's how we coming, bro. That's how we coming. I ain't even finna play around and just act like I want to go lower. I'm not. I'm trying to go high. I'm shooting for the moons past the stars. You feel me? And just like that, gang, the job is freaking complete, bro. So I have to come to the back, put the battery pull back on, man. Cause everything hooked up. Make sure if you unplugging anything from your car electrical, make sure you um, freaking take the battery post off, bro. If you taking off like sensors and stuff. Is this the right size? I grabbed a 12, I'm gonna grab a 10. But yeah, I'm gonna get down there and show y'all how it look under there. Since I gotta get the 10 anyway, I'm going here real quick. <clears throat> so y'all see the header is installed, the passenger side. So we good, man. So yeah, we're gonna tighten this up. And we're gonna run and go get the keys. I don't know why that jump loose still. Understand why that's still loose because it's tight as it can go, yeah. That's tight as it can go. I ain't even worrying about it. I got it so it don't come off, it ain't gonna come off like that. Twisted moment of freaking truth, man. I still gotta put the shield under there and put that back on top of the what's the name? So I'm gonna pop the hood so we can go look under the hood too. Hopefully that got it, man. I pray that got my leak. Pop that head, man. It's not gonna sound good, bro. If it's if it's sealed, it's not gonna sound so good. I can't wait to hear it. I can't believe I'm done. Can't believe I'm freaking done. 